the bullying part. Like, even if we apologize, would she- would they have let us go? Also, where is Rika? Where's Rika? Where's the girl that actually got bull- that apparently got pushed by K? She's never shown up. I don't even know if she exists. Like... <sighs> and Ayano Koji and Megane just watching this, right? Megane actually wanted to move and say, Yo, this is fucked up. Yo, this is fucked up. Ayano Koji, do something, but no. It's not enough. I kind of like this about Megane. Oh, he stood up. That's not talking. You had, you know, you're taking pictures of her. You're fucking just had her bangs like that. So it's not, it's not over. It's not over. And even if we apologize, will it be over? The bullying's gonna continue. I know, but like in this state, if I was her, I don't think I would want other people's help. I'd, I'd be like too ashamed of myself. No, 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 no. This is perfectly reasonable. If I was her, what do you mean perfect? What do you mean we'll try it? What's he gonna try? What do you think he's gonna try? Venus group. I forgot what group that is. There's so many. Yeah, they guessed correctly though. Um, Jupiter was Koenji's group, right? The thing about Class C, someone explained too, is that he has so much of an advantage because he has everybody on an eye. He rules Class C with an iron fist with violence, right? So he every, he knows everybody's like and like uh, picks already, right? That's why he's more favored in this situation against Ayano Koji. But what's Ayano Koji gonna do about this? What's he gonna try? Based on the lighting of this, if K is here, okay, because we saw the scene in the trailer where uh, Ayano Koji was basically just kind of like went like this to K's. Uh, is she here? It's not Hiata. No, 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 we're more- Oh my! Is that Rika for the first time? So she does exist. How did they know? How did they know that K was here? You, you don't think that Ana Kuji would have tipped them off to see just how much more of a bullying it would happen? So they're basically going to do this until she apologizes in the most- Dogeza basically means get on all your fours, right? And basically bow, right? So until that happens, they're not going to let that- But look at Rika's facial expression! It's almost as if- She's like, didn't really happen. Like, 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 I, I think you guys are blowing this out of proportion, but it's like, I can't really do anything about it because these girls have already pushed it so far. Right? I, I. What kind of vibe? Yes, she has in the past. So, they can kind of already sniff out a victim, huh? That's kind of fucked up that these girls kind of already kind of like felt like, oh, you feel like a victim. Like, I feel like I can push you around, that kind of thing. I guess that's what happens when you're in Ruin's crew, but... And this is like, if you think about it, they're just going, Dogeza! They're just clapping like this, but like to her, other than the hair pulling, this is like a trigger. She just thinking about everything from the childhood. Re Dude, that's kind of fucked up. Whoa, whoa, that's actually a lot of damage. Yo! I mean, they've done worse, but a slap? I mean, Rika again. Rika's like, no, 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 this never happened. She's got, she can't do it, obviously, because she knows this is wrong. Anokoji, dude, come on, save her, please. Somebody, please. She can't. Oh, that was a little bit harder. Yo, no one asked for the backhand. No one asked for the three piece combo. This is. This is fucked. This is fucked. This is. Okay, now she's starting to smile. She's starting to like it. Now, she's become a bully. Yeah, now she's corrupted. Okay. And now she's a piece of shit like the rest of them. I know Koji's right there. How did she. Did he tip them off? You don't think they. What's the Milgram experiment? Yeah, they're talking about Rika right now, right? If, if, in the beginning, she was like, I don't want to do this, but now it's like. Oh shit, slap is kinda fun! Fucking take this one, just like... He tipped them off! Bro, this is so fucked! Do you have to go this far though? He... Does he... Will save me time. Because when she's at rock bottom, then Ayano Koji can do what he wants with K. Whether... I don't know what that is, but here it comes! This is the scene from the trailer. So he's gonna like recruit her, but it's like, what's the deal gonna be? What's the contract? Like, I'll protect you or something, if as long as you do anything. And remember, K said in front of the mirror last episode when she was talking about childhood, I need to be able to be to do anything possible, right? Okay, he's he's kind of starting off. He's kind of starting off strong. Okay. 
平田を呼ぼうとしても平田インカメンあいつとの偽りの関係もいじめられていたことも俺は全部 So what are you gonna do with this information? He's being very straightforward. He's not trying to like deceive, expose. So, <laughs> can't slap me. But like, he's that's the scene. So I can expose you that you were a victim, a bully in the past, and other people might bully you more. That's the incentive. Do whatever I tell you to do. Okay. And he's still explaining, you know, what the front that she puts on. Does Ayanokoji even care about stuff like that? I like. Like, he's never really shown an interest, or is it, is it the fact that I can't really read him at all? Because we just have the poker face the entire time, right? Like, when Krishna was like, oh, spread your life! For what?! Are we doing this right now? He's not- I mean, the look in his eyes, he's like, do it! But is it- it's probably a test, right, to see. Okay, will you really do anything I tell you to? Not yet! Yeah, like what? What? She's just like testing the waters. Yeah, pretty much. She's doing it though! Like in this situation, they just collapse, they just abide by the will. An abused victim's mindset. Like right now? So, so then, let's get fucking revenge on the Class C girls, man. Something bigger that we still do. No, 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 the hand was going a little bit above. Okay, okay. I thought it was going below, but no, 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 he was taking the scar. He was taking the scar. Okay, come on, he's a gentleman, right? So, again, the scar, the actual, like, she probably got carved out with a knife in the past. So what's the deal right now, man? You're speaking in very abstract terms. Are you telling me you're that darkness? Or are you telling me that you can protect you against this darkness? As long as you do whatever I tell you? Okay. But. But. He include, he include Machina too. <laughs> Even though. I don't think he was in the scene. Was he watching? I guess he was watching their interaction. Threatened them. So it's like reverse. I mean, we don't want them to expose it, but I mean, like, that works. Class D. But we need K for that? Control of the girls. I thought Suzune would be that pinpoint, right? He acknowledges Horikita can't do it. Because Suzune is too cold. At least K can put up a very bright front, right? Again, people have already said this, but the perfect tool, right? The will to do anything. Just do whatever I say. Okay, so how is K gonna help us win this test right now? She's not the VIP. No, what do you mean? What did you just say? What did you just say? Did you just say you're the VIP right there? Wasn't there a question of in the previous episodes how Aonu was like hinting at K is the VIP because she always puts up a cold front, I mean, a, a very positive front, right? To hide the fact that there's a very fucked up past thing going on. But in, in the current situation, she's not putting up that um, front anymore. And that's why it was like something else is going on. I think K might be VIP, maybe? I don't know. I think I missed something important there with the teacher. <laughs> My bad. Ichinose, what's up? Gonna check her phone to check his VIP. We know that each knows it has no ass, man. We've already seen in the previous season. You remember the massage scene? Fucking nothing. Oh, when she has a better ass. I don't think it's the morning. That's how you react to when someone's already up and like kind of watching you. <laughs> okay. There's something I want to ask you. Two point six mil points. Where did you get it? Yes. That is the goal. Well, that was like Susan's goal, but. Come join us. Come join our class. He mentioned it. Mm, don't join our class! No, 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 no. But what if you join our class? She alluded to this in the previous season. If you have all the points, you can do anything, including changing classes. 20 mil? Wait, wait, wait. 20 mil is the, is the requirement to switch classes? Was that it? Or did I miss something there? Did you leak the points on purpose? I bet she did. It, she, it's not your fault. I think she literally just showed you it. The 2.6 mil was fucking crazy. Crazy, because we were like scrounging for like a thousand points, remember, in the first season? But she had 2.6 mil, I was like, what the f- I won't pry. Don't pry into my life, remember that scene? Yo, you guys are ruining the moment, guys, come on. 
You guys are ruining the Yes, you did! Well, kind of. The way Ichinose operates is so interesting to me. Because she's so straightforward, so positive, but she's very stern in a very positive way. And she leads. We all unite to correctly guess. And that's the class, that's the KSA situation, right? Where everybody wins. But again, as long as one fucker betrays us, then case B happens. And that's not good. Yeah? I mean, just prove VIP or not, yeah? How about we show them the fake VIP somehow and get some idiot to guess wrong and deduct their points? Wouldn't that be funny? Oh? Oh, who's... Ichinose is kind of provoking Machida right now. True, you were kind of neutral. Like, you didn't do anything. You didn't gain anything by trying to be safe. Because he's playing not to lose, right? He needs... He doesn't need to play to win, but... And he figured that out. I had no clue. <laughs> Ichinose is acting. Hamaguchi, oh my god. You're doing exactly everything I told you to do. Good job. All right, might as show my phone too, yeah? But K will be the VIP, right? K? But no VIP? I guess no VIP there, huh? Wait, wait. So I guess my guess of K being the VIP was wrong. Wasn't that... Was he the VIP? Was Machina the VIP? You? Megane? Why are you... No poker face from him. That you won't tell everybody? Mm. Now, could you imagine if this is a plan? Some like acting between, but I, I don't think you can fake this test. You can't fake this, right? And if everybody shows their phones, then it's gotta be legit, right? Unless that email, we can somehow fake that and make someone guess it. And then Ayana Koji makes that class, deduct their point. Oh! Performance! So my scenario, Yukimura was a better actor than Hamaguchi. Ichinose and Anokoji were both in it. Well, not in it together, but they were acting as if, you know, I'm just doing this. They sent their pawn. He executed it perfectly. Megane executed it perfectly. Now, one of the C-class girls, right? Or one of these guys. Oh, look, they're smirk, right? They're gonna guess. Class A. Class A is gonna fall for that trap. But how do we fake the email? How do we fake it? You were actually the VIP? Wait, wait, wait. But if you cheat the cell phones... You still have to show your interface. Uh, 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 uh. Ichinose, why? You didn't have to do that! Uh, she's too smart. I just happened to call it because I definitely did not have a hunch that, you know, they were, you know. Oh my god, we just got outplayed. We just got played. Unless, unless, no, 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 no! Have faith in Anokoji! Have faith! This is a double pronged attack! Mm, the stage is still being set. Come on, I don't know, come on, you have to tell me. You can't. No, this is all still part of the acting, right? Please? I mean, it's not like I bet you guys would betray us, but. <sighs> Unless this is all part of the act. Please, please, let this be a two pronged plan, right? This is still acting, right? He wouldn't. She wouldn't fuck up like this, would he? He's too good. He has to have thought of the situation. Two prompt plan, right? So, okay, K was the VIP. Jesus, I'm just kidding. Fucking just mind fucked. But but the initial assumption was K is the VIP based on you know what Anko told him for double layer trap. So this is a two stage plan. Oh my god, Ichinose was in it with us. Oh my god. So we switched. Switched, but I don't still I still don't understand how he was able to kind of fake that email. I guess it's not that big of a deal, but because I you know I thought the email was say you know VIP, but I got that's right. And each knows it will call us out. But we intentionally make each knows it calls. Uh, what? We're working on SIM cards now. So we bought extra SIM cards? That's what the scene with the teacher was? I'm gonna have to return to the scene or someone can explain that a little bit better with the SIM card mechanic, but essentially, it was a two-prong plan. Passed exactly, because they're like, Oh, you mother you are lying! And they're so hyped up and they left, right? Immediately as soon as the discussion was over. Did Ayanokoji know about this? Or did Ichinose intentionally do I thought they might have planned it two together. Because she just wanted to kind of show her worth to Anokoji, maybe? Is it really only that? I feel like there is some truth in that, but also I feel like she's really trying to get on the Anokoji's plan. Come on, Ichinose. You ah, come on! You know Anokoji did this! No, 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 no. She is. 
Just the way that Anakoji has... Huh? What? A special class... Oh, I... Uh, but but A class whiffed it, but C class one because again C. <laughs> he's gonna come in. Oh, smell Susan's hair, yes. <laughs> yeah, because again he had a major advantage. Everybody submits to him in C class, right? He knows everybody. Krista. Oh? I mean, it was leaked, but how did you find out, though? Susan is was it his her reaction? <laughs> You're not gonna take some pictures again. Every time Riven talks like this, I feel like he's indirectly saying, kind of talking, and like, "Hey, Anako, are you listening right now? I'm talking all this shit. You're gonna you gonna react to something? Well, nothing. Okay, this time. Okay, next time then maybe. Hmm. I need to review this part of the test for sure. But, yo, this episode was fucking cracked.